Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I will show you how to add a static route in Linux step by step. I will use Ubuntu and Arch system for the demonstration. Static routes are essential when your Linux server needs to reach specific networks through a particular gateway. Whether you are working on a cloud VM or on-premises server, this guide will help you set up static routes permanently and temporarily. Well, what is a static route? A static route tells your Linux system exactly where to send network packets when they are destined to a specific IP or network. Unlike dynamic routing, these routes do not change unless you modify them manually. It's useful in multi-network environments, especially when the default routing is not enough. Let's say you want to reach a network 192.168.50.0/0 via the gateway 192.168.1.1. So for that, we can add a static route using the IP command. All right, let's jump into the our Ubuntu system first. Let's verify the network details. Then the command IP add show. So this is my network interface, which is currently attached to my Ubuntu system. And this is the IP address assigned to this interface if I run IP route show this will show me the default gateway for this interface all right now set the static route using the IP command for that run the command sudo IP route at destin network via gateway IP. Dev and then followed by the interface name. It's ENS160. Hit enter. Let's break down this command. This IP route add adds a route. This is my destined network or the network. This is my gateway IP address and dev ENS160 specify the network interface. So for this network, the next hope is this gateway IP address. Now let's verify the static route has been added or not. Again, run the command IP route show. You should see an additional entry for our route. This confirms that our static route has been added successfully. But the static routes added with the IP command are temporary. To make them permanent, we need to edit the configuration file. I mean the network configuration file. On Debian based systems like Ubuntu, we have a NetPlan utility which controls the network configuration. Go to the folder etc net plan. There you will see a network configuration file with the extension YAML. So this name could vary as per your setup. So let's edit this file using the VI editor. Under the route section, add these entries. So this two specify the destined network or the IP address and via is your gateway IP address. So this means request towards this network will go via this gateway or we can say for this network, this is the next hop. Let's save and close the file and implement these changes using the command net plan apply now rerun the command ip route show then the static route is now persistent across the reboot next move to the rhl system let's do the same let's first set the temporary route but before that get the 
IP details first, then the command IP add show. This is the IP address. This is the interface name. And if you run IP route show. So this is the default gateway. In order to set the temporary route on RHL system, we can use the command IP route sudo space ip route add we want to set the route for this network 192.168.60.0 slash 24 via gateway 192.168.1.1 and the interface name is ens160 hit enter all right again this ip route command is used to add the route this is my destined network for this network this is the next hope or this would be the gateway ip for this network and we are using the interface ens 160 let's verify whether it is implemented or not again run the command ip route show Output confirms that the static route has been added for this destined network. But this static route is not persistent across the reboot. When the system gets rebooted, this static route will be removed. In order to set the static routes permanently, we need to modify the connection or create a new connection using the nmcli command. Let's try to add this static route permanently. Run the command sudo nmcli connection show let's first get the connection name so as of now there is one connection with the name ens 160 for this connection this is the device name or the interface name all right now edit this connection run the command sudo nmcli connection modify connection name is ens 160 and then plus ipv4 dot routes in double quotes first specify the destined network 192.168.60.0/24 followed by the next hope ip or the gateway ip 192.168 one dot one hit enter in order to make these changes into the effect we need to make this connection up in the command sudo nmcli connection up ens once the output confirms that this connection has been activated successfully let's verify the changes Rerun the command IP route show. That's it. You have now learned how to add both temporary and permanent static routes in Linux, whether you are using Ubuntu, RHL, Rocky Linux, or any other distribution. This method will help you control traffic flow on your network. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to Linux Techie, hit the bell icon for more Linux tutorials every week. Drop your questions in the comments. I respond to everyone. See you in the next video. Bye.